Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a review and I am going to be trying out this product. It is the Revolution Make Makeup Revolution London Forever Flawless Unconditional Love Palette. And this one I found out at Marshalls for $4.99 and it usually runs more. And I did um, find it online for $15 at the website. But um, um, deal. I feel like it's a really good deal since um, online it's like ten dollars off completely. It does come. It's a very nice palette. Super cute. It has really pretty shades, couple shimmers, and um, a lot more mattes. But it has pink, so I really like the pinks in there. And then um, it's just perfect for this time of year. And then. You can also um, transition it to next um, year, but it's a really nice palette. And then I'm going to show you guys some sh um, some swatches real quick. So um, the first one here is this like dark brown, and this one's called Promiser. Let's see how it looks on the arm. And I did read all right reviews in between, so I wanted to see for myself. So that's how it looks. It's not that pigmented. The next one is this one, it's like, um, right here it's called Official Lighter Brownish Tan Color, and they feel very buttery, I like that, but they're not as pigmented as I thought they'd be. Okay, next color is Koi, so this like orangey brown color. Or more like peachy color okay that one's yeah they're not really transferring that well and then the next one is platonic it's a shimmer very light like lavender shimmer okay it's very light next one is attached that one's a purple color not too deep more on the burgundy side okay they all kind of like transfer the same this one is a salmon color this one's called swipe okay that one's i feel like they're all transferring the same not as pigmented so the, the next one is the light pink and this one's called the first date And that's a really nice shimmer okay and then the next shade is this one it's a lightish brown color and this one's called committed okay so the next shade is this one it's the proposal right here it's like a gold color Okay, and it's showing up nicely. The next color is blushes. Okay, and it's a really nice Barbie pink. And the next color is Cherish. Okay, and then next color is Love Potion. And that one didn't come on that good. And then the next shade is Adore. And that one's a really nice like brownish shimmer. And then next color is Dinner, reddish color. Okay. And it kind of looks like this one and this one combined. And then movie is the next one another shimmer and this one's a deep purple and that one looks nice um next one is love better and this is a very brown reddish color i'm gonna put it right here that one's showing up deep and then next one is unconditional pink color light pink Okay, and it's kind of showing on, it's not that good. Um, the next and last color is Love, and this one's a really peachy, light shimmer. Okay, 
okay okay so soon for the shimmers are pigmented only a few weren't um, these aren't showing up and I feel that one's not showing up all the lighter colors aren't showing up as well but I'm gonna see how they look on the um, lids to see if it's any good on the lids but yeah um, I am gonna start the book okay so first thing I always put some base on this is a Morphe to um, hide and peak concealer okay so after putting the the base on I'm gonna keep it simple so I'm gonna use um, this color blushes right here that Barbie pink and I'm gonna be using this fluffy brush and I'm gonna put it right here and then on the crease and then downwards Um, I'm gonna do the same thing to the other eye. Okay, so far I feel like the shadows are coming on powdery on the lids. To me, it doesn't it doesn't look bad, but it just looks kind of powdery on my end, and I don't like that. And then the next shade or color is first date, and I'm gonna put that pink in the middle that shimmer and then that looks nice okay so so far um i find that the shadows were very powdery um so the next thing i'm i am gonna be doing is using some um eyeliner and this one's elf active eyeliner in black for mascara i'm gonna be using this la colors mascara this is um, in black and I'm going to be creating a wing with this Red One Color Stay Skinny um, liquid liner. And I'm just going to be creating a small wing. So that's pretty much it for the liner. So, um, so far it looks good. I am going to move on to the full eye uh, face and then I'm going to come back for the lips. Okay, so I'm finished with um, the rest of the face. Now I'm going to be using this Too Faced lip gloss and this one is high shine sparkling lip gloss so this is pretty much the look um i feel like for uh, as far as the shadows they were very powdery i feel like i needed to like pile it on a couple times just so i could get the color right and it didn't look like dusty but it is not my favorite i do not recommend buying this you guys i think i see now why it was 4 99 and why it's going down and it's on clearance now online but it is $15 online still I did get a good buy I didn't spend that much on it so I'm really happy that I didn't spend that much but yeah that's pretty much it you guys um it, the colors are like really powdery all of them that I, I did put them on my arm and they just suddenly disappeared like I didn't I just put down my sleeve and they just disappeared they're not pigmented at all and yeah, they just completely disappeared. That's pretty much it. I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye.